the dragon here. Shit. Nah, I didn't do that anyway. Hey guys, welcome back to Dragon Mountain to the Dragon here. And today we are playing the Eternal Knight. And I think it was this one we did all of. Going back to the There we go. Now it's back. There we go. Anyway, we're playing um, the Eternal Night because I want to talk about the Reignited Trilogy. And where I don't have any footage of the Reignited Trilogy because it's not out yet, I decided we'll go here because if you watch the Dragon Challenge, it's all the way through. We never saw the end. But we're not talking about this. We're talking about the Reignited Trilogy. That's what we're talking about. My thoughts and my slight concerns are, well, they're more for me than anybody else. Um, more or less, if, I mean, if you're, well, I can't even say if you're a fan, um, if you originally grew up with this spot, or not this spiral, but, um, the original Spyro, the, uh, PlayStation one, and you're gonna feel right at home in the new game because Boys from Bob did an absolute fantastic job redoing it. Like, there's honestly nothing new in the game that wasn't there when you played it however long ago. I mean, everything's exactly where it originally was. Nothing's changed. Nothing's been messed with or anything like that. Nothing at all. I mean, coins are not coins, the gems are still in the same places, money bags are still in the same places. I mean, I mean, it's almost like the game never left. Honest to God, it is. It's like, you know, it's just been updated to the newest thing. As far as gameplay goes, the exact same. The exact same, just as it was before. Now, here's some differences I find that for me personally, I might find a small turn off to the Reignited Trilogy compared to the Legend series, and if it had been remade. Now, if you notice here, the enemies have health bars that take, you know, one or two hits, you know, and they vary. all just like basic enemies from the gameplay from E3 is that most enemies take one to two to three hit or like take like one hit maybe two um, or maybe they're very because let me be honest here when I say this and I've said this many a time but honestly I haven't played the original like I most one or two levels at least and when I ran the other videos back, and I think they were February when I ran them, to see, you know, when I was hoping or saying that it was going to be Legends because Xbox screwed up the title in the magazine, which I was hoping they didn't. I kind of hoped they had didn't, but they did. And I was kind of hoping that it was Legends. Um... the videos I didn't mean the sound oh, 
Never did. I never did. Like I played one, two, maybe three levels at a friend's house. And so, but I grew up with the legend, so I did prefer it, or at least hope it got. It. Now, does that mean there's no possibility that it can be? No, not at all. There's always a great possibility. Poison Bob did a hell of a job with this. I can't wait to see if they do do it, how well they'll do it. Oh, I didn't All right, he's done. So, I'm excited. Okay, it's save like that. Unleash Dark Spire. Load your save game. Experience the power by pressing press to transform. I might have to do this again as Dark Spire. Holy shit. That's close. I want that power. So that's what you get. Dope. But anyway, guys, what this video mostly is, is me saying, or me putting down the original Spyros, the ones from PlayStation ones I didn't play. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to knock some of the fans that I did on my social media, like Twitter that I use, Dragon Mount Game, my personal one. Um, I didn't mean to, like, I never really had seen many fans of The Legend of Spire, so I kind of thought I was kind of out here on my own trying to defend this game, or at least this trilogy compared to the others. Either way, I'm happy Spire was going somewhere. I mean, Skylanders, not to knock on them, which I'm not. That's still some people's first beginning with Spire, whether or not to actually play with them or somebody else. It was their, their first days. It wasn't what... We liked or what we grew up with, which I can say I kind of did, considering I was born in 1997, so Spyro was released in 96, so a year after it was released, I was born. I, oh wait, no, Spyro came out in 98. I was one before he came out. My man. So I never had the chance to experience it, but now I'm going to. I have pre-ordered the trilogy. It's coming out. Or should I say it's going to? It's going to come out. And, um, well, it's coming out September 21st, and I'm going to play it, and you're going to see my actual first playthrough. Like, this is my first taste of these games, what you guys did. Now, Spyro has led me to find great many, many great friends on my social media, and also helping my channel grow. So, if you were the fans of the originals and maybe didn't like Spyro, I want you to be welcome here, too, to the channel and to like the videos. And I don't want you to think I hate the series because I screwed up. And to the friends I did meet and maybe some of the friendships I may have killed by doing it and may never be able to replace, I apologize for that. I didn't mean to. I did it, and I'm sorry. And hopefully maybe those bridges can grow. Maybe we all come back to the channel at some point. Maybe. I don't know. But I'm going to give the videos and the game when it comes out my best attempt, my best open mind that I possibly can. And hopefully make a good series and maybe find a match with you guys. But some of the fears I have, at least for me, which I mentioned is the enemies in the game. I'm a big fan of open world, but I'm also a big fan of fighting stuff. And so far, the only two fighting styles I've seen is Spyro's Fire and his Ram ability, or his Run attack. The flying, we really can't... I mean, it's about the same as what we have in Legends. You know, you can flap up a little, or maybe it's just one jump, and then you can just glide. Maybe there is a double jump. I don't, I'm not really sure. I'm hoping there's a double jump. But... 
hopefully, 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 there is, and hopefully I'll like it. Hopefully I will. Um, I'm not going to disgrace. I mean, if I don't feel like I can continue the series and do a good job at it, I'm not going to. I'm going to shut it, shut it down. But we'll see what happens in September. But anyway, guys, I want to say I love you all. I'm glad I met a lot of you through this game. Whether or not it be good experiences or bad, hopefully we can change, excuse me, change that. And I want to say thank you for watching, at least, at least giving some put into this video. I want to say thank you, and uh, hopefully I'll see you soon in a room.